Hello everyone, Shadefire here, and it's time to hollow ourselves out, because it's episode 3 of Let's Play You Are Empty. Alright, so we took the car from the city, and now we're out in kind of rural, rural Russia. These are not functional doors, even if they look like them. Man, these hospital patients are all the way out here. Well, we pretty much gave him the old Soviet healthcare plan there. Oh yeah, those ammo boxes are definitely not <laughs> the same amount every time. It was only three bullets. So I might have to actually go back to conserving my ammo a bit, at least on the non-harmful enemies. I saw this was here, I just, you know, was looking around to see if there's anything else. I guess the other question is, why are we here? I suppose we drove away from the city to, you know, get away from the crazies, but uh, also is that supposed to be the Kremlin? Looks a little too close. Also, kind of weirdly JPEG. Skewed. Oh, that guy has a shotgun. Well, now I have a shotgun. I'm sure it'll be just wonderful and impressive. <laughs> the steam sets me on fire. Oops. Alright, so you cannot aim down sights with the shotgun, as you might expect. It's just, you know, left click one shot, right click two shots. Well, guy wanted me to rap with him. Doing pretty good on health. We haven't really had a situation where I was near death yet. Yet. Maybe I should have picked hard. <laughs> Is he just firing at the ceiling? You damn varmints up in there, erratic. Mishka, I tell you to lay traps. Wow. That is an effective shotgun. Two shots to the chest, no big deal. Kind of look like so I need headshots to make the shotgun effective, which maybe defeats the point of a shotgun. Oh, there is dead wife. Why is she glowing sometimes? I'm trying to flip her over so we can get a good look at her gamminess. Okay, so he fell down here. Oh, okay. I see what we need to do. We need to shoot that barrel to blow up those boxes. I got hit in the face with a box. God damn it. That's a gas mask guy around. One of the pistol guys. I don't know where that's coming from. Oh, he's up there. I didn't actually see anything explosive. I just kind of shot him in the chest and he blew up. He's got really big hands. And you know what they say about Russians and gas masks with big hands. At least I hope you knew, because I don't. Oh, there's the dags. Yep, they're uh, pretty dangerous. They run up and attack the air in front of you. Alright, so the shotgun sucks. <laughs> I think we're just going to have to accept that.
Something has been wrong with the hens the last few days. They're gaining weight too quickly, they're growing more and more by the day. Okay, so I'm guessing the enemy I've been waiting for is coming up soon. I think you can probably guess what it is. Is that a really big doghouse? I feel like they got the scale off a little bit here. Maybe the doghouse is also growing larger by the day. Can we go through here? We can. Alright. Bit more of an open area. Another dead woman. Oh, she is not dead. Alright. Kind of gross looking. You know it's serious when the music kicks in. And a woman slowly walks towards you. Executed. Soviet Russia, lazy housewife, he's execute. They have a distinctly bird-like look to them. Well, the shotgun's at least good against killing women. As rednecks have probably learned for years. What's up with these dogs? They're like not even attached. There's just an open gap full of metal pieces. Some fucking clockwork virus SCP shit going on here. I'm hoping at some point we'll learn what exactly turned everybody into metal combination pieces. Alright, so that'll do it for episode 3, I guess. Again, I don't know how long... Okay, there's a lot of women here that are going to get up. I don't know how long these episodes are going to be. I don't know if some of these levels are going to be really big or what. But, uh, yeah. That'll do it. I'll see you next time, and we'll get our fill of emptiness once again.